If you're looking to do a river cruise, most especially a Christmas cruise, then you came to the right place. We will be boarding one of the beautiful ships of Emerald Cruise Lines. Let's go! wondered what river cruising is all about. What is the difference between river cruising and ocean cruising? What is included? What's not included? And what sort of activities can you do? If you ask yourself these questions, you're in the right spot. All discovering the ship, its amenities, services, and how is it to be on a board. We've also created a separate video about the destinations and Christmas markets. Make sure not to miss that. Welcome to our room. This is called a panorama balcony suite. Here we have our queen size bed. And let me show you the bathroom. We have this mirror where it hides the cabinet. And you can put your stuff here for easy filing. Here, a nice size bathroom. Let's go around. Another neat feature in this ship, they provide you with whispers. This will allow you to hear what is being discussed by your tour guide when you're outside and walking around. You also have a phone here where you can call the front desk if you have any questions and a small vanity mirror or desk for you to work at. A TV. It will also feature on a day-to-day -day basis where and what time is the tour as well as what time is the dining. And down here are your drawers where you can put your clothes, mini bar, and your safe. The mini bar is not included in this particular category. I'll show you later on which one's included. The extra closet space. And in this room, they also provide you your bathrooms and slippers. And this is our balcony space. Very panoramic. You have an option. Lower the glass down just by pressing this button. And there you have the view. You also have several shades based on what you would prefer. And if you prefer to sleep in, we have blackout curtains as well. And if you have your own projector, you can actually use it for that. You're probably wondering how is the rest of the ship. Let's do a quick tour. We're currently on the third deck. We'll go all the way to the back. And here we have the pool area. Let's go take a look. Pool and lounge area. But the most important about it is that at night it transforms in something magical, which we'll show you a little bit later. Also here you can grab yourself a drink as coffee or tea, which are also included. Our beautiful walkway, which leads to the lounge. Here is the place where usually all the events are. We have here musicians coming in, or if you want to just grab your coffee and have a wonderful view, and on the days that you just want to relax and lounge, they also provide here some newspaper, books, and games. As well, you can have here the light breakfast and the light lunch. Also, a bar that you can grab your drinks. The light lunch is served right now, actually. A little open area right on the bow of the ship. If you get cold, they have you covered. You have blankets here. There's some heaters right here. Here we have stairways that will lead up, but as the moment is closed, the reason why, because we have a lot of low bridges, so they don't allow anyone to go up. When the top deck is accessible, you can have a walk, play mini golf, or enjoy the views. Now we'll go to the second deck. Here on the midship, you'll find the front desk. We'll be glad to help you with any questions you have. Now let's go back to the third. Here we have the gym with two bicycle machines, a rowing machine, and a bench of free weights. And let me show you my favorite room, massage therapy.
The ship has in total 92 cabins and the passenger capacity is 182. Right underneath the lounge on the second deck in the front, we have the restaurant where they will serve breakfast, lunch and dinner. We're about to go have lunch. Today is served German food, which means a lot of sausages. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Anatoly. I will be captain on next cruise. I come from Ukraine. Thank you for support. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Yuri. I'm executive chef in Ameraldon. Welcome on board. My name is Ovidio. I'm coming from Romania and I will be the gentleman responsible for your fun on board. And I would like to recommend menu for tonight. And for the starter, I would like to recommend Dutch marinated herring with the potato, onions, quill egg and vinaigrette. For the main course, I would like to recommend pork filet wrapped with the bacon and prawns. And for dessert, I would like to recommend the glazed chocolate dough with the amaretto cherries and cookie crumb. Thank you so much and bon appetit. Morning. We woke up really early today so that we can have breakfast. Do a fun activity. Fun fact about canals of Amsterdam. It's estimated that about 25,000 of bicycles annually being thrown in the canals. Can you believe that? Did you know that if the canals here in Amsterdam are all connected, it would be over 60 miles? And here are a total 160 canals. And not only that, there's actually a lot of locals that live in houseboats in the canals here. And there are over 3,000 of them. Can you guess what our next activity is? Board a glass top canal boat for a tour down a UNESCO World Heritage listed canal system. Welcome to Amsterdam, a postcard worthy destination of cafes, art galleries from famous artists like Van Gogh in picturesque canals. We will explore the narrow cobbled streets and windmills of Amsterdam on a separate video. Don't miss it. Now back to the ship before we start sailing. First day of sailing starts with the safety trip. MJ is very excited about it. This doesn't take much time and afterwards it's all fun and games. I'm now headed to the lounge to try out my first mood wine. Thank you. A mulled wine, or otherwise known as spice wine, is actually an alcoholic drink. It is famous here in European Christmas markets because it makes you feel warm. The ingredients are red wine, mulled with spices, and sometimes they do it with raisins. It's usually served hot or warm. Cheers. It tastes like happiness, so it's in the cup. It's really good, actually. Tonight, we have a beautiful surprise for you. Right here with us, we have the amazing Tommy Timerson, and he is playing a beautiful instrument called the zither. Around the world, there are only 2,500 people playing this instrument. Out of these 2,500, there's only five that do it professionally, and he doesn't like to hear it, but he's the best. Don't go to Germany without learning proper German. We need to learn how to get beer in Germany. The uh, gigantic city of Ausfahrt. You know, that's the... No, it just means accent. Yeah. An entrance, that is an Einfahrt. Shipping is a Schifffahrt. A round trip is a Rundfahrt, yes. And a car trip is an Autofahrt, yes. 
the roads lead uh, to Auschwitz. He, uh, <laughs> the Guinness Book World Record longest word in the world. Go now, dump shifts, fast electricity, Hauptbetriebswerkbau unter Beamtensgesellschaft, bitte. Yes. Lovely. Buy beer. Something very common here on the river, what you'll see it a lot. It's the locks. The river is on a different levels. As the boat goes up, we pass a lot of locks. This is done on a very high skilled level due to the very narrow space. The total width of the locks is 12 meters, while the ship is 11.45 meters. That leaves only 0.55 meters for both sides of space. I don't understand why there's one pair of shoe on several doors. Is that like a sign or something? Are they supposed to get Santa gifts? They're gonna have a stick or they're gonna have some candies or something else. We just told that that's how they celebrate Saint Nikolai here and uh, you'll get something in a shoe. Whether you're good or bad, we decided to join Saint Nicholas and see if he will give us gifts. <laughs> Hey, you got something in the shoes? Nothing. There, look. There's nothing. Really? Oh. <laughs> What's that? It's a bear. <laughs> bear too. <laughs> Breakfast is served here as a buffet style. Tomato and onions. Lunches here are served buffet style salads and starters. As well, you can order a main dish. Grounded beef with rice for lunch. And I got fish with couscous. And they serve spring rolls. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> What's beautiful about the dinners here, every evening they have a specialty menu and it changes every night. They serve you three course meals. Some evenings it is based on where the location is at. Every day they will have a vegetarian option, a pescatarian and a meat dish. Good time sir, we got sea scallops with lobster sauce. So it's quite savory. In the head of the lobster, it's actually pretty good. Roast beef fillet. And I got a cat with mashed potatoes. The most refined mashed potatoes with the cat, which is soft inside, but it's a little bit crispy on the outside. Perfect. Can I try? Smells good. It just melts in your mouth. That's how tender the beef fillet is. For dessert, we got an apple cinnamon slice with vanilla sauce. Mm. I got a selection of cheese with nuts and dry fruits. All non-alcoholic drinks are included uh, during lunch and dinner. Alcoholic drinks and specialty wine from the region are also included. Every night, you'll be served two types of wine, white and red, but they would be from different regions in every evening. You would be from France, Italy, Germany. Steak with mushroom sauce. The last night. Salmon. That's falling. So what's beautiful here is that they will always try their best to accommodate you. And I ordered my chicken with rice. 
wish the rice is not in the menu. <laughs> Isn't that magic? Do what you want to do. This morning is just so wonderful. Just looking at all these castles, forests, it's just gorgeous and magical. This journey along the rivers Orion and Main takes you through the medieval towns and palaces. Christmas markets. Get immersed with local communities and really get to know a destination. Christmas cruising is a great option to break the monotony of old celebrations and to create new traditions. How do you know if river cruising is right for you? Here is a no if you're looking for a variety of amenities. Unlike big ships, there are no production shows, no big pools with water slides, nor speedways of go-karts. It is a yes if you prefer smaller ships. Emerald especially is a more intimate type of experience with simple in and out embarkation. Prefer doing things on your own time and schedule. If you like structure, Every day, everything is planned out and done at a scheduled time, including dining and activities. If you prefer simple fast food, no burgers, no pizza available. Dinner can be a two-hour event served in a several courses, and you may have to sit with other guests you don't know. If you like superb, fine dining meals and are open to experiment. The menu is mostly designed with seasonal and regional flavors meant to tickle your palate and you get to meet new and interesting fellow guests. If you're looking for a party scene, activities and entertainment, it might be limited. It is for you if you prefer a laid-back and calm crowd. They have enriching and cultural activities on board. On a budget, River cruises are known to be more costly than other types of cruises. Premium all-inclusive experiences and paying everything up front. No seasickness. River cruising, it's a slow and gentle ride. It is enjoyable and has a beautiful scenery all the time. It is an intensive look of the region, more focused on the destination, highlighting its culture and old historic towns. Now we will show you the rest of the other rooms available in this ship, coming from the lowest tier up to the highest one. And if you're looking for a simpler experience, a 162 square foot room might be perfect for you. A queen size bed. The bathroom is the same as the other balcony rooms. Closet, safe, bar. Something cool about this room is that the water is actually at this level. So as you peek out, you will see the water just barely down here. Everything you need to have your comfort while you cruise through the river. Another special stateroom that we have in this ship is the Solo Insider. And they only have two, so you better hurry up and booking it if you want to snag one. This here is a cozy twin bed closet, very roomy. It also includes your safe and mini bar. 
uh, the bathroom is a good size where you have a shower, a toilet, and everything you need. This room is perfect if you're coming alone and you don't want to split the bed with anyone. We are now in a grand balcony suite. Let me show you the big difference with this one. It has a walkout balcony, which is really, really nice. It can be separated with this glass door. It also includes Nespresso cafe machines a pillow menu and you can have things such as anti-aging pillow neck pillow for neck problems and also they provide you non-allergy ones welcome to the one bedroom owner suite where we have 315 square foot nespresso coffee machine safe box and fully stocked bar all included in this room we have your tv a separate living space from the bedroom come here, you have this walk-in closet. If you come further, and here is your king-size bed. And here's the bathroom, toilet, your sink, and your shower. And you also have a vanity area or workstation. In this room, it is included breakfast in the morning in bed. And what's really beautiful is that you have your panoramic balcony. What makes this cruise extra special are their amazing staff. You would always be greeted with a smile and top-notch customer service. And this, our friends, sets them apart. Do you see yourself ready for such an experience? This is Victor and MJ. Thank you for watching.